I am working on case half number two today, getting ready to bore it. This one looks like it's going to be even a little easier. Don't have the threaded holes in the main, so I just run one stud through nuts and washers on each side. Should be able to clamp a couple of places up top. And the best part is the only thing since that cylinder is offset compared to the other one, I don't have as much clearance issues. And on this one, we've got this big nub sticking out. Remember, I had to shave right up against those two holes on the other one. Well, this has got that large nub, and the only thing hitting the bed is the very edge of that nub. So all I've got to do is round that off a little bit. Everything should clear fine, and we can bore this out and have this part done. Boring out the second case half is complete. Everything went just beautiful. It's in there just like I wanted. The only thing I had to do this time is when I first started cutting, I had the cutter or I had the case perfectly centered where it was making a nice even cut all the way around. So it was spot on then. But as I got closer to full diameter, I noticed it was a lot closer to one of the stud holes. And I didn't want to break through on that side. And I'm assuming the stuff was just made a little bit off. Because like I said, I had the cutter centered perfectly in the beginning. So I just started, I noticed this in enough time that I could just tap the case a few thousands at a time to the side and make another pass until I got it centered out between the holes. So once again, didn't break through on any of the sides, so I'm happy. Now I'll break out the TIG and we'll fix that corner on the other half of the case. And the corner is welded back up. Just need to shape it a little bit. That'll be good as new. Just knocked the pin in the hole and welded right around it so I made sure it was still aligned. Case corner is all repaired. Got the pin in it, lots of meat. So let's uh, slide this together. Now that is starting to look a whole lot like a little airplane engine. Everything fits just great. Next up, I'll be going through, and I'll be drilling and tapping all the holes in the oil galleys so I can put the plugs in it. Then it will be should be, I still need to plug a hole up here. And then uh, we're getting close to final cleanup. Need to drill and tap those two for the cooler. And it's getting closer, still a lot left to do, but it's definitely getting closer. I know this is taking a while because I am slow, but I have lots of different hobbies and it just takes me a while. But I promise you, eventually this will, you'll get to see it start up and run. And hopefully, eventually, it'll actually be on the airplane. So if you want to keep up with this build, you know what to do. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.